Little game crank here with another Flat Earth video because Flat Earthers love to troll my channel. So keep that trolling coming because it's a whole lot of fun to debunk you people and to show you how wrong you are with science instead of pseudoscience. And for those of you who have flat brain friends, this will be an easy way to shut them up by asking them a simple question. I got lots of them, but for today, we're going to be going with what's a meteor? What's a meteorite? What? No answer? Why not? It's a very simple question. What's a meteor? What's a meteorite? Ever see a shooting star? Across the sky? Oh, you'll say that's just a projection on the dome. The firmament can't let anything through, because there is no space anyway. And the dinosaurs weren't real, and that meteor crater in Arizona, USA, that's not real either. That was dug by the Illuminati. Okay, well, while you deny all that, what about one that happened during your lifetime? 2013, Russia. You know I was going there, didn't you? 1,500 injuries. Yeah, people were hurt. But no, they're imagining that, right? They're lying. They're Illuminati. They're shills. Because anybody that doesn't agree with you in the end, that's all you got left is your shill. So, why don't you confront them with that? And while you're confronting with them with that, I'll wait back here and watch you get your ass kicked. You people are nuts. You say, well, then it was the military. Oh, well, wait a minute. If you've done your research like you say you do, of course you don't, you just get in this echo chamber of Google algorithm of the video suggestions on the side that keeps giving you things you want to hear from the cults like the Dubays and the ODDs and the Sargents and the Dranisms, and you just keep on this echo chamber of nonsense to make you think you have special knowledge that nobody else in the world possesses for some reason. <laughs> But if you've done your research, the military answer doesn't work because this was clocked at about 40,000 miles per hour entering the atmosphere. If you had done your research, you would know that the military doesn't possess anything. Any military in the world doesn't possess a projectile that can go that fast. It can only go about 4,000 miles per hour, not 40,000 miles per hour. So now there goes your military meme. Okay. So then you'll say, it was on a rocket. It was on a, a missile. Okay, well, wait a minute. 30 meters in diameter. 13,000 metric tons. Right. Let's see you get that aboard a rocket or a missile. Good luck with that. Well, then you'll say, oh, it was an atomic bomb. Well, you might be on a little bit of the right track there because it was actually about 30 times the amount of energy expended as opposed to the Hiroshima bomb over Japan in 1945. We did have 1,500 injuries after all. But with an atomic bomb, there's that funny thing called radiation that nobody seemed to measure. And there's something, another problem called an EMP that would have been there and would have destroyed microelectronics in our modern age that nothing would have worked or would have destroyed a whole lot of things. No reports of that. So there you go again. you got a problem, don't you? I actually witnessed one myself. The U.S. state of Michigan. It was at night. Heard this loud boom. Now, frankly, I wasn't outside at the time. I didn't see it. I heard the boom. But, as any researcher can do, I went online and I looked it up and saw there was a meteor, meteorite, and I was able to track where it went, and I was able to see all sorts of things about it, and I was able to see... YouTube videos from regular people that posted their videos the next day showing this coming in. So I was able to confirm what I heard, even though I didn't know what I heard at the time. I was able to confirm it. But I don't even want to do my research, do I? So while you're busy with your echo chamber of stupid, keep trolling the channel. It's a lot of fun to show you people. And for all those who have friends that are flat brainers, Pose these questions, keep them coming, because I have a lot of questions I can give you to shut them up for good. Thanks for watching. Ho, ho, ho.